So this is the lodge again here in uh, Zollikofen in Switzerland and the number 116 apparently it's all over at all the uh, at all the lodges and like if you turn it around uh, well, like if you turn it around you get Yeah, well, this is the lodge here in Switzerland. If you turn it around, the number 116, well, you get this here. And um, so, why 116? Apparently, um, apparently, many lodges are on the number 116. Well, I'll tell you why. Because that's the date 1160, and I was in the middle of the Crusades. And what happened 1160? Um, the most important Templar got born. His name was Simon de Montfort. And what does it mean, Montfort? It means strong mountain. And where's the strong mountain? Well, it's here in Switzerland. And the one that's missing here, Le Neuf Sur, which they took away because of me, mm, it's because of the nine. Templars, that's why it's Le Neuf Sir. Well, they're not sisters, mate. Well, they were queers actually, with the buffalo man and all that. And Simon de Montfort, so Simon of the Strong Mountains, his, fa his father was Simon de Montfort, and his son was Simon de Montfort as well, the, um, the fourth Earl of Leicester. And um, he was a real butcher. During the Fourth Crusade from 1202 to 1204, he butchered lots of people in Constantinople, which is Istanbul now. And in, um, he got very famous, notorious for butchering the Qatar people in, the, in southern France. So with this, he opened the two gates for bringing the, uh, the Templars treasure through the east or through the west into Switzerland, into the Montfort so the strong mountains so this guy is very very much related to the uh, foundation of switzerland and the templars so this is why this number here and if you turn it around you get 911 1160 okay yeah well and this also is the temple uh that gave the um so lenef sir the nine of uh, the nine templars that gave the Statue of Liberty, which is actually Isis. They gave it to, um, well, we know whom, eh? And Mr. Simon of the Strong Mountains, so Simon of Switzerland, he, um, he was a part of the Dominicans as well, you know? He was a real butcher. And this is what they like in Switzerland, butchers. You know, financing wars and killing people all over, like in the Second World War, they finance everything. So the Swiss like butchers. It's the home of the Templars. The biggest criminal organization there ever was. And this is actually what, um, what Hebrews and, um, and uh, Muslims have in common. They were both butchered by the Templars. And it's both Swiss banks who come from the Templars that finance the dictators and that finance Adolf Hitler. So guys, team up. You've got a lot of things in common in the Middle East. This is the enemy. The Templars and Switzerland, their banks, their mercenaries, and Simon of the Strong Mountains. 9-11, they did it. So here is the lodge again on number 116, as in the year 1160, of Simon of the Strong Mountains. And here I took a picture a couple of years ago, where we can still see the um, the lodge, Voltaire aux Neuf Sœurs, the Nine Sisters, you know, um, giving a link to the uh, to the Nine Templars, the original Nine Templars. Well, these queers probably call themselves sisters. 
as the uh, abuse of children and all that, you know, with the, um, yeah. So it says number 116, you know, with the buffle math thing. And here, is a, there was a, um, is one of the, um, the pamphlet, the, uh, the posters, the Swiss uh, made, you know, uh, Nazi things, racist things by uh, portraying foreigners in this one as black crows. You know, picking into the clean Switzerland, the strong mountains of Simon of the Strong Mountains, eh? And we already saw that they portrayed the foreigners as black sheep, as rats, as snakes, as um, well, a lot of other things. It's really horrible. This is the uh, this is the heart of Nazism. It is. You see, here's a temple again. There. So. These guys are hiding something, eh? They took away the the nine sisters, and the nine sisters were the ones that gave the uh, the Statue of Liberty to the ones on the other side of the dip. And uh, and here we can see how they play people out against each other. That's what they like, the Freemasons and the Swiss, eh? So that banks, the Templar banks, they can gain money on that. This is what they always do. So you guys in the Middle East don't bash your 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 heads in, you know, with each other. Team up against the enemy, the real enemy. And this is the real enemy of both of you, of the Muslims and the Hebrews. So team up, get together and fight the real enemy. These ones here in Switzerland with their banks and their Templars. Okay. Peace up, eh?